guys, today let's play some Overkill. This is one of two shoot 'em ups released by uh, Epic Mega Games. Uh, well, two of the more interesting ones. The other one is Killer Blaster, which I also have a video of. And this was released back in 1992. And um, one thing is, like, uh, for some reason, this game doesn't detect my VGA graphics adapter in my DOS box, so it's displaying CGA graphics, which is why the color doesn't look that great. Um, but rest assured that there is a VGA version of this game, and on a proper PC, which I don't, I don't have an actual old 386 PC or something, but on a proper PC, it's going to have better graphics than this. This is just the CGA version, and it's not detecting my graphics properly. But let's just, sh I'll just show you the gameplay anyway, which is what you guys are interested in. So I think this is a, this is playable on CGA graphics. It's fine. It's just not as good looking, but it's fine. And the other thing is this game works best when it's played with a joystick. Um, when you're playing with a keyboard, I used to play with a joystick back in the day. And uh, joystick just fires much, much faster than a keyboard can. So basically I have to spam my spacebar button. I have to spam my spacebar to fire. And uh, the other thing is you have to do that because uh, in order to get upgrades, you have to kill all the guys. And if you don't kill all the guys, you won't be able to get the upgrade. And uh, you see on the side there, you see weapons, missiles, gadgets, upgrades. Basically, the more upgrades you save, uh, the more powerful it will be. So the first one weapon is the least powerful, whereas the second one, uh, missiles is more powerful than that, and gadgets will be more powerful than that. So you upgraded my gadgets here, and then the fourth one is the most powerful, which is upgrades. So you can either save up for a more powerful upgrade, or you can just upgrade sooner and get a less powerful upgrade, but you get it sooner, so it's a matter of speed over power, I guess. Okay, let me move. Yeah, so weapon upgrades, your weapon missiles will give you some little side firing missiles, and um, gadgets will basically increase your ship, and upgrades itself will make your ship much more powerful. This will make it a lot easier, I do, I do like this form of the ship. Yep. It's much more powerful than my basic ship. Alright. So, oh! Okay, when you die, you lose all your weapons and, their, and upgrades. So basically, I had, to st I had to start over if I wanted. There's no way I can beat this without getting all my upgrades. So that's one of the problems with this game is that... Can I any of these things hit me? <coughs> Can I any of these things hit me? Oh my god. <coughs> oh, shoot. Oh my god, I made it. 
Cool. Okay. So I upgraded twice now. So I should be able to get through this. This game is pretty brutal though. If you don't get any of the up if you miss any of the of your upgrades or you die and you start over, there's no way you can even beat the first level basically. You basically have to get all the upgrades and you cannot die even once. Yep. So you have to avoid all the ships, you have to um, kill everything. So this game is pretty unforgiving in that respect. Oh my god. Okay. That was pretty difficult actually. Okay, level 2. And I lost all my upgrades. <laughs> I just start all over again. As my basic ship. Oh, there we go. I got my upgrades. Okay. So I guess I lose all my upgrades for the first part of the game. Okay, anyway. So much better if this was in VGA. Let's see how I found this third one. Oh shoot. Oh, I can't get any more upgrades. I can get upgraded to fighter. That's what. Oh my god. Did not see that coming. Okay. Well, now I'm pretty much dead. Um, there's no way I can win now because I lost all my upgrades. Okay. Well, yeah, that, that is overkill. Um, it is a pretty good shooter. It's just pretty unforgiving as well. So if you... If you die at even one time, then you're basically screwed because you need all your upgrades in order to finish the level. So, uh, even the first level is kind of challenging, so yeah. Overkill.